Hi, this is Meenakshi Jolly, and we are talking about a medicine called hydroxychloroquine or Plaquenil that most of the lupus patients are on. This is a very uh, light medicine in terms of how much it suppresses the immune system. It's one of the least strong medicines. It has too many benefits for lupus patients at very little risk of harm and that is why we think that uh, most lupus patients should be on it unless they have allergy to it or intolerance to it or have developed side effects to it. Um, what this medicine does in patients with lupus is it, it helps with their skin problems from lupus, it helps with joint problems, tiredness, um, constitutional symptoms, nonspecific symptoms, it decreases the risk of death over time in patients with lupus, controls the flares, um, the risk of damage also is decreased from the use of this medication. In addition, it has a lot of beneficial effects on the kind of cholesterol, uh, the bad cholesterol on our body, and um, uh, therefore this is uh, considered to be also useful for that. In addition, this medication can decrease the risk of uh, blood clots in patients who uh, have uh, increased chances of making blood clots because of their lupus or antiphospholipid antibody syndrome. Um, hence, we think that this medicine is really, really very important for patients with lupus. Uh, thing to remember is that there is some data that says that people who smoke in those patients, this medicine may not work that effectively. Hence, if you smoke, consider quitting smoking if you want your medication to work for you effectively. What is the harm? There, the medicine is usually very well tolerated. We think it is a very, um, it causes very minimal amount of suppression of your immune system and um, rarely at high doses after years of use it can deposit at the back of your eyes and affect your vision that is why your doctors ask you to get eye examination from an eye doctor not an optometrist that checks your eyes for the prescription for your eyeglasses but an eye doctor who would put drops in your eyes dilate your eyes and look at the back of your eye um, this needs to be done every year. The recommendations uh, are currently being changed and um, it, uh, some of the associations are suggesting that you may not need the uh, eye examination that frequently. Um, that depends on um, doctor's preferences and which recommendations they are following. However, you do need to um, have eye exam for this uh, medication if you're seen. Uh, if you are on platform.